let's talk about large language models. This is going to be short, even though there's a lot you can say about it. I just want you to uh, remember a key thing about large language models. So a large language model is a foundational model that implements the transformer architecture. And we're going to spend a bit of time learning about the transformer architecture in upcoming videos. But uh, the idea is that um, you have natural language. I can get my pen tool out here. So we have natural language as our input. It goes to the large language model. It predicts uh, output for words. And as it produces each word, it feeds it back in and continues um, to produce until it is done. So during the training phase, the model learns semantics or patterns of language, such as grammar, word usage, sentence structure, style and tone. That's what makes it so good at, at uh, interpreting uh, uh, language and giving things that sound with uh, uh, language understanding because it has that ability to um, understand the semantics of language. It would be simple to say that LLMs just predicts, predict the next sequence of words because as you use the model, it outputs a word on the end of it and keeps feeding it in and, and in and again and in until it's done. But the honest truth is researchers do not know how LMs generate their outputs because there are so many layers um, and there's so much going on there that at this point right now, the level of complexity makes it very difficult to truly understand how it is reasoning its output. Um, but it looks like it's just doing word for word, but there is a bit more to it, okay? But there you go.